All right. Now we're doing Freight Code Camp, JavaScript Algorithms and Data Structures Beta. Learn basic JavaScript by building a role playing game. Step 76. All right. So, what if the player doesn't have enough gold to buy health? When we want to run code conditionally, we can use the if statement. All right. And that's a pretty important one right there. Uh, an if statement is used to make decisions in code. The keyword if is followed by a condition in parentheses. If the condition is true, the code inside the curly braces is executed. And if the condition is false, the code inside the curly braces is skipped. So here's an example of an if statement. All right. So we've got const num equals five. So we've got the if and then inside of these parentheses, like it says right here, we've got num is greater than or equal to three. So if num is greater than or equal to three, it's going to do this console.log, right? So since num is greater than five, this is going to run. But if num was two or less, it wouldn't run at all. It'd just skip right past it, right? So we're going to start by placing all of the of our code, pardon me, all the code in our by health function inside an if statement. So for the if statement condition, we're going to check if co pardon me, if check if gold is greater than or equal to 10, right? And we're doing that because it subtracts 10 each time from gold. All right. So for this one, let's come down here and we're going to say if, and then we'll say if, uh, what was it, gold is greater than or equal to 10. We'll have the curly braces like this. We'll drop it down one. And then we'll get all this stuff right here from 78 to all of 75. We'll do a control X on that since we don't need it anymore right there. And we'll drop it off right there. Let's uh, bring this one back up like this, and then let's uh, highlight all these and tab it over one so it looks a little bit better. All right, so now when we go to the store and we buy health and we just keep buying health, keep clicking, ah, it's not going to happen anymore, right? So that's a good thing. Let's check the code. Looks good. And submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 77, and we'll see you next time.